Welcome to Blue Mountain Bike Park. My name is John. If you're new here, consider subscribing and hitting that bell to get instant notifications when I upload new content. Located in Palmerton, Pennsylvania is PA's largest downhill mountain bike park. All you need are two wheels and a little fearlessness, right on Pennsylvania's highest vertical located in the foothills of the Pocono Mountains. There are 28 trails where there's always a new challenge whether you are a hardcore mountain biking expert or you are just starting out. The high-speed Comet quad lift is spinning to get you back to the top so you can ride the mountain over and over again. When you first get to the park, you will hop on the chairlift and head to the top. It takes about 15 minutes to get up. Depending what day it is, the lift lines can get long, but it's generally a pretty smooth process and you will be riding in no time. Yeah, brother. Woo! Once you're at the top, you can go right or left. Let's stick to the right for now. On this side, you will find most of your blue tech and free ride trails. Let's check out the Boulevard. This is a blue flow trail that will take you pretty much down the entire mountain. This is the perfect trail to warm up on and to get your bearings. There are no jumps on this trail, just flowy berms. You will be able to split off this trail and take multiple other trails at many points. So let's check out TBD. This is a blue tech trail that is a very good trail to introduce you to tech. It's fairly forgiving and you will find smaller features and rock drops. After that, you will find yourself back on the boulevard, which will bring you to Wild Turkey. Wild Turkey is another blue tech trail that is about the same skill level as TBD. Both are awesome fun trails to get warmed up on and learn. Next, you will find yourself at a blue flow trail called Dual Slalom. This trail is exactly like it sounds. It consists of two mirrored lanes that have rollers and berms that you have to pump your way through to get to the ending. You can also jump the rollers if you feel comfortable. After dual slalom, you'll be at the bottom of the mountain at the chairlift. Back to the top of the mountain, if you head to the right, you can take a connecting trail called Skytop. This is a blue flow trail that has a drop and gappable rollers. This trail will bring you to the start of Miles of Smiles and El Camino. Let's take the right and head down El Camino. El Camino is a flowy jump trail with drops and tables, but again, everything is rollable. You could really bomb down this trail and send the jumps. This is a perfect trail to introduce you to what the mountain really has to offer. El Camino ends up at three trails. You can continue down El Camino, hit the drops on Miles of Smiles, or take the new Upper Empire Freeride Trail. Let's take Upper Empire. She's tasty, brother. <laughs> yeah. This is a black flow trail. Every single jump on this trail is well out of my comfort zone, so I generally stay off of it. But if you have the skills to clear them, this trail is perfect for the more experienced rider. Right at the beginning, there's a massive drop to send you into the start of the jumps. This trail consists of tables, step ups, and step downs. They are absolutely massive. They look much smaller on camera. Not gonna clear any of these things. Never. They're huge, dude, holy fuck. After Upper Empire, you could take on Lower Empire. Lower Empire is a black flow trail. Here you will find big jumps, drops, and wall rides. While everything is still rollable, you shouldn't go on this trail if you don't know how to jump a bike. It's not a very forgiving trail and you can get really hurt. After Empire, you can go to Ewok Village. This is a blue flow trail with smaller tables, step ups, and step downs. The trail speed is very wrong on this trail and I have seen many people crash because of that, me included. Just modulate your brakes and you will be fine. Remember, pre-ride, re-ride, free-ride. Ewok leads into a learning feature called the progression drops. These are three wooden drops that vary in size to teach how to drop properly. After the drops, you will be on roller coaster. This is a fast, tight flow trail that takes you right to the lift to end out your run. If you feel you are ready for the black tech trails, you can go to the left off of the lift to find a trail called Formula. This is a black tech trail that will really test your skills. It's very rocky, very rough, and pretty steep at times. You start out on a wooden roll-in ramp that leads into a small rock drop. This trail is one of the best on the mountain, but you will want to watch your line choices as you head down. After Formula, you will find a trail called Upper OCS, which is a black tech trail. OCS is very steep and rocky, and it spits you out at lower OCS. Lower OCS requires about the same skill level, but there is a rock drop at the start. Do yourself a favor. Don't stop on the trail. I OTP'd! <laughs> Towards the center of the mountain, you will find a black tech trail called Loose Cannon. 
This starts with a drop that sends you into tech features including a road gap. It's pretty mellow until you get towards the bottom of the mountain, this is when you start to encounter your gap jumps. Back at the top, you can find a black tech trail called the Schwartz. This is a very rocky short trail that leads into TBD. After TBD, you can find Happy Yummy Fun Trail. This is a fun little blue trail that zigzags on the side of the mountain. Here you will find berms and drops. This is the perfect trail to learn how to hit drops. They're small and very easy to hit. The trail speed is correct, so you can do this entire section without touching your brakes. All in all, Blue Mountain Bike Park is a super fun mountain to really learn how to ride downhill MTB. It is a little on the rougher side, but if you have good grippy tires and you set your suspension up correctly, you won't have any problems with grip. That's all I have for today's video. If you like what you saw, consider subscribing and hitting that bell to get instant notifications when I upload new content. All clickable links down below in the description. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.